Good morning. <laughs> there's this painting over here that's red and there's light shining onto it, which is why I think I look red right now. Anyways, it is what it is. Hello, we are back at the theater. It is Monday today. I didn't work this weekend and my intention was to not vlog on Saturday and then to vlog all day Sunday and that didn't happen. So here we are. I haven't even edited the last vlog, whenever that was from, because I was a busy girl. So on Saturday, I was like, I'm going to edit. I'm going to edit all day. I want to get at least 10,000 words. But in my head, I was like, if I get a little bit more, that's awesome. Especially because I done like 16,000 the last two days. It's so dark. I'm so sorry. The lighting is not any better. I should just move up some lights now that we're not open. Whatever. I'm sorry. Anyway, so... I just washed my hands when I came in. It's okay. So I was like, 16,000 is ideal. 10,000 is goal. 16,000 is ideal. Anything else is cake. I edited it like 35,000 words almost, just shy of it. So that's exciting. I have about 35,000 words left to edit. So that's very exciting. And I definitely thought about spending all day yesterday as well editing, but I was like, no. You said you want to have a chill day. You said you want to marathon Lord of the Rings and bake bread and build a fort. I didn't build a fort. <laughs> I did, however, bake bread and I marathoned the first two Lord of the Rings. I had a late start to the day because um, I was a bit lazy. I think I'm gonna move. That's better. We still have the red because of the red, but it's okay. Anyways, so I got through the first two Lord of the Rings. I'll probably watch the third one soon. I've honestly, if we're talking about Lord of the Rings, I've only watched Return of the King a couple times. Anyways, I've watched Fellowship so many times because I watched it like for the entire year between when Fellowship came out on DVD or VHS at the time and um, when it came, the Two Towers came out. So yeah, that one, I've, I still know all the words to it or the, the lines. Anyways, so I did that. I baked bread. I jailbreaked the house yesterday. I got outside. Um, <laughs> And we brought a loaf of bread up to my grandma. We stopped at Timmy's and went through the drive through and we brought her a French vanilla. And then I got a hot chocolate. My mom got a coffee and we put everything on her patio. And then I called her and I was like, go outside. She's like, what am I? Go outside. And this took quite a while. And finally she went outside. And then we had a nice visit from respective distances. And now she's got a nice loaf of bread. Uh, which is nice and fresh. And then my cousin was the main reason that I baked bread yesterday and I like couldn't get a hold of anyone in the household and finally got a hold of my aunt. My aunt was like, oh, nobody's going anywhere today because it was like later. And I was like, okay then. I don't know what to do with this extra bread. And then like 20 minutes later, half an hour later, my cousin was like, I just got this. I am coming. And so she came and got the bread. And so from a safe distance, we also had a little bit of socializing. So that was very exciting. Man, these are weird times we live in. My mom dropped me off at work and then she was going to go to the grocery store to see if she could find yeast because yeast is a very hot commodity right now. And if I'm baking bread, I need yeast. And um, I was like, be safe. Go to the grocery store. Weird times. Anyways. I'm at work now, as you can see, and I'm probably just gonna work for five hours today. I need to figure out like hours and schedule and stuff. Like I, I need to work about 20 hours each week. So if I work five hours for four days, then that works. But also because I don't wanna be taking the bus in this time, so I have to make sure that somebody's available to pick me up. And like my mom's working a lot. She's a cashier, front lines, and her boyfriend is working a lot. He's on, transportation stuff so he's like front lines too it's actually funny because he's like a casual employee and he has been like working non-stop this last week because people have to quarantine and if they're coming back from vacation and all that stuff so weird times but i'll probably see one other person in the theater today and i think that is it the lighting is just as bad i know anyways i'm gonna go now have my breakfast drink get started for the day oh oh weird thing when i was coming in to the door I like looked down and on like the little curb just beside the door, there was a banana that had been spray painted bronze. What? Anyways, I'm going to go now and I will check in with you along the way if I can. If not, I will see you at home. And I think today we are going to try to do more editing. I want to get this book done. We're so close and it is currently the 23rd. So we still have a week left, but I just filmed an entire three and a half minute long clip with no audio. Mm -hmm. 
mm -hmm, it's going great. All right, so let's just um, recap everything. It probably won't be three and a half minutes because I was rambling. So basically I forgot I was vlogging and it is now 20 after three. I was at work and work is just such a weird situation right now because it's like there were four of us in the building today but we're all like distancing and like I was in the bathroom and I was coming out of it and like I hit the automatic door thing and then there's another girl on the other side and she was like really confused I'm like oh you want to come in here huh okay well I guess I need to back up six feet so it's weird but it's fine um I worked till one then my mom grabbed me and we went and got some food on the way home and then ate and then I just had some chill time and then I had like the longest shower ever which was amazing and I got into like the frumpiest clothes I could find which is like this oversized sweater which is so cozy and a pair of sweats I really want to have a nap have not decided for sure if I'm gonna nap or maybe finish Lord of the Rings I still have Return of the King to go but just like gonna have a chill day not planning on doing much my mom and I need to at some point pull the turkey out of the freezer because we're gonna do a turkey tomorrow because we have a turkey in the freezer because don't normal people just always have a turkey in the freezer um, but that'll give us a lot more space in the freezer especially because this Thursday it's been about two weeks since we shopped last so we're gonna grocery shop and um, get some food for my grandma as well and then just hunker down for another two weeks and it's not that we're out of food like we still have food but you know all the good stuff goes first and so it's um just great if you don't need to like it's great to have the option to get the good stuff again <laughs> you know like i don't even know what i'm thinking about but you know the the basics like the milk and stuff we have so much cheese right now it's stupid i don't even know like we had a bag of cheese and I didn't know and then I was like oh these ones are on sale so I bought two more bags of cheese and now we have so much cheese so I should probably eat some cheese but that's where we're at and then once we shop back into the quarantine not quarantine we're not quarantined we're self-isolating or social distancing or whatever the heck you want to call it but yeah so that's the update I'm gonna go check in with my mom see what she's doing see if she needs help with pulling the turkey out otherwise I'm probably just gonna like have a nap or watch Lord of the Rings or play video games. Oh, that was the other thing, is I picked up an extra set of Joy-Cons. Well, I, I ordered them online. So I now have these lovely neon green um, Joy-Cons to go with my red set that came with my Switch. And yes, I'm the type of person that I needed them to match. It was too stressful for me to not have them matching. And like, when I was thinking about getting a Switch, I was like, I can't get the red and blue one because they're two different colors. So I was going to get the gray one, but then there was this one that was double red. Anyways, I'm going now. I've basically rambled for the same amount of time. Ah, not concise at all. And um, I'll check with you on the road, see if I'd be productive and like edit my book or not. The Lord of the Rings movies are like the longest movies ever. I decided to continue watching Return of the King. I don't... Did I start it like right... I don't know. I feel like I started it right after... I edit the vlog clip, but I don't think I did. But I only got through the first half of Return of the King. It's so long. And I've only seen Return of the King like maybe three times, like in the theater, and then once on VHS and once extended edition, I think. So like three times. And um, I think there's a reason why. <laughs> it's it's not as good as the other ones. Like Fellowship is amazing. Two Towers is pretty good. There's a couple issues with it. There were not elves at Helm's Deep. <laughs> I'm still mad about it. And well, actually, technically there were like three elves because there's Legolas and Elrond's son. So it's three, but Haldir was not there. Anyway, um, <laughs> So just watching this movie just makes me want to read Lord of the Rings again. So, and I've read it like a million times. So I got rid of Throne of Glass, which was the book I was going to read. And I was like, oh, you just go back on the shelf. And I pulled down Fellowship. So I'm probably going to start reading that on Audible. I've been listening to Harry Potter, except today, I think the other day when I was listening to it, I was like, there's something off about this recording. There's something off and I couldn't put my finger on it. And then today I was listening to it and they said Merry Christmas and I was like, aha, and I checked and it's Harry Potter and the Sorcerer's Stone, whereas I read Harry Potter and the Philosopher's Stone, which is like the Canadian slash UK version. So I'm listening to the American version. So they say Merry Christmas instead of Happy Christmas and they say jumper or they say sweaters instead of jumpers. And yeah, so anyways, I'm re rereading that. Um, and I've got the second one queued up ready to go when I'm done this. I've only got like 45 minutes left 
of the Philosopher's Stone, so that's exciting. But it is just about quarter to nine. I am going to sit down and do some invoicing before I lose my job. I don't think I will, but I did get an email from my boss saying, hey, when we're invoicing, can we do this instead? I was like, yeah, okay, I get that. I get the subtle prod. So <laughs> I'm going to do that now and um, then hopefully have an early night because I have not been going to sleep early at all for a very long time. That's fine. And then if I get invoicing done tonight, then tomorrow, hopefully, I can work on editing my book. I want to finish that so badly. Okay, I'll check with you in a bit. Alrighty, I've mostly been sitting in the dark with just my light on for like the last two hours, I think. I did the invoicing. I decided just to buckle down because I was like, oh, I should just do this. And it only took an hour, which like, is actually a lot of time because normally it takes me much less. But it wasn't too long. And then I decided that I was going to edit one chapter. And then I was like, well, the next chapter is only like 2,000 words. So I was like, well, I'll edit that one. And I was like, well, maybe I should do one more. And it was like 4,000 words. So I was like, maybe I shouldn't. And then I did. So, excuse the lighting, but I did 8,862 words today. I picked off all my nail polish today. I mean, not all of it, but most of it. Yeah. <laughs> so I've edited it just over 107,000 words and then I have about 26,000 words to go. That is quite easily doable by the end of the month considering today is the 23rd so I still have like a full week so I should be able to get that done hopefully maybe tomorrow even. I don't know. I'm gonna work tomorrow and then I think I might do a long shift on Wednesday and then I won't have to work for the rest of the week. I feel like it's stormy outside. It sounds like it's really windy and stormy but I don't know too lazy to look. Anyway, um, I'm gonna climb in my pajamas now and climb into bed. I did not finish watching Return of the King, but I'm okay with it because I was a lot more productive. So yeah, we're good with it. So I'm gonna go now and I will see you next time I vlog slash when I eventually edit this. I'm behind. It's fine. <laughs> good night.